This video is sponsored by DreamWorks Animation. Hey, Spirit Pals! We're so excited to be sharing another Cheyenne Frontier Days adventure with you. Yes! Today we're going to be visiting the Chuck Wagon Cook-Off. A Chuck Wagon is kind of like a traveling kitchen where cowboys and cowgirls cook out while they're on a ride. We can't wait to start cooking. But before we do, have you clicked our subscribe button and the notification bell yet? Do it below right now. Okay, let's go! Dad, what are you doing? Oh, oh making dinner. My famous stew. Do you know how to light the stove? Okay, pals, Lily and I just got the brand new Spirit Riding Free book, Apple Adventure. It's a really fun story. The pals discover a whole apple orchard and make a new friend. And since we love all the apples, we thought it'd be fun to do a truck wagon kickoff challenge. Oh yeah, apple treats, humans versus horses. Okay, pals, meet our new friends, Mr. and Mrs. Fred Woods and June Woods. Welcome, girls, to the Chuck Wagon Cook-Off Challenge. Thanks for having us. Hannah, you can cook with June. Your challenge is to make a horse treat. Whoa. Lily, you can cook with me. Our challenge is to make an apple treat for humans. We're going to cook with our 1875 Chuck Wagon today the old-fashioned way. Iron pots, hot fires. All right, let's go. Hannah, come let's with go. me. Here's what you need for your horsey cookie. One apple, one carrot, one cup of molasses or honey, two and a half cups of oats, a Dutch oven, and we use two to three tablespoons of vegetable oil to grease the pan. Today, you're gonna have adult supervision, grating a carrot and an apple. Next, we'll mix all of the ingredients together in one bowl. I bet Senior Carrots would love this. Take it away, Senior Carrots! Now we're ready to start spooning these cookies into a Dutch oven. We'll put the Dutch oven lid on, and then we'll take the Dutch oven to the fire pit where coals will be placed around it and on the lid. And that's what makes it an oven. That's so cool. Uh, we're going to leave those cookies in the Dutch oven for 30 to 40 minutes, and then we're going to find a horse and give them treats. OK, Lily, are you ready to make an apple cobbler? Yes, I can't wait. It's going to be just like when Abigail was making her pie. Is the crust brown enough and even enough? I hope it's cooked all the way through. Did you not hear the part where I said, wow? Here's what you'll need for your apple cobbler. 12 medium apples, peeled and sliced. <laughs> <laughs> Two cups of sugar, a quarter cup of cornstarch, four teaspoons of cinnamon, more or less to taste. Four teaspoons of nutmeg, more or less to taste. Six tablespoons of melted butter, one cup of dark corn syrup, one tablespoon of lemon juice, one teaspoon of salt, one store-bought crust, and a Dutch oven. Here's how you make the apple cobbler, chuck wagon style. Put all of the ingredients except the store-bought crust into a pan and heat it over the open fire until the mixture gets thick. You'll need a grown-up or a chuck wagon expert to help you with this. Grease your Dutch oven so the cobbler doesn't stick. Once the mixture is thick, pour it into the Dutch oven. Then we put the crust on top of the apple mixture and put the lid on top of the Dutch oven. You'll need a grown-up or a chuck wagon expert to put the Dutch oven over the hot coals and to put the coals on top of the lid. Cook the dish for about 40 minutes and it will come out all gooey and delicious. Okay, Hannah, our cookies are done. We've let them cool. These look awesome. I definitely think a horse will love these. I think you're right. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to lift up the lid and make sure you have an adult for this because those coals are still hot. Okay, so we take it. Put the lid on. There's your cobbler. Are you ready to taste it? Yes, 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 yes. Ten times. One trillion. Yes, yes, yes. I don't know about you, Lily, but these are some good cookies. I think mine's better because that's for horses and this is for humans, so. Well, clearly Pickens agrees. Do you agree, Pickens? <laughs> yup, oh, yes. she agrees. <laughs> okay, girls, I think it's time for a little taste test. Hey, right, let's see. Here you go, Pickens. Aw, do you like it? Do you like I it? I think Pickens likes it. Yeah, yeah she wants more. Yeah, so Pickens loves your horse cookie. 
I've never had an apple cobbler before. This is my first. You ready? One, two, okay. three. Um, mm, mm. Oh my gosh, it's like heaven. Thank you, Thank you so, so much, much for letting us do a chuck wagon cook-off challenge. Well, girls, I think you're both winners. I don't think there's any contest here. Nope. Thanks for cooking with us today, Spirit Pals. Are you going to try any apple recipes at home? Tell us in the comments. Also, tell us if you plan to read Apple Adventure. This book is available in stores and online, wherever books are sold. Just be sure to ask a grown-up before you buy anything. And make sure you check out Spirit Riding Free Ponytails on Netflix, the new short drop, August 9th. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends. Bye, Spirit Pals!